My name is Brenda Von Gova, founder of the UN Chamber Music Society. Today's special concert on World Day for Social Justice is in support of all the homeless women in New York. It is dedicated to helping thousands of women suffering from homelessness through Invisible Women, a nonprofit organization based in the United Nations International School. Invisible Women is a nonprofit, student led organization committed to helping to make our community a safer, happier, and healthier place for women on the streets and transitional shelters in New York City. From job discrimination to lack of affordable housing, for them and their children, homeless women in unstable living conditions face many challenges. These issues make the daily lives of homeless women in need immensely difficult. Here comes the invaluable work of Invisible Women. I would like to thank all the musicians who helped to make this concert a success. I would also like to thank the friends of the UN Chamber Music Society, including the Mayor of New York City, Bill de Blasio, and New York City's Commissioner for International Affairs, Penny Abiwadina, for their support to this occasion. And of course, special thanks to the Executive Director of the United Nations International School, Dr. Dan Brenner, for his kind message of support. Finally, I would like to express my sincere appreciation to New York Philharmonic cellist Patrick G for his generous support to this concert. We are very proud to feature the community of the United Nations International School, including Amane Muyura and Kristen Mayola, co-founders of Invisible Women, who represent the promising generation of future global leaders. May they inspire you to come up with innovative ideas and pioneer solutions to social justice challenges. Thank you for helping to make a difference in the world. May the music you're about to hear today help us all reflect on World Day for Social Justice and remind us that we are all equal. Every human being should enjoy dignity and equality, including homeless women. I thank you. Hi, my name is Penny Abby Wardina. I am New York City's Commissioner for International Affairs and on behalf of Mayor Bill de Blasio, it is my privilege to join you all to commemorate the Day for Social Justice. On this day, we as a society take time to reflect on and recommit ourselves to tackling, tackling poverty and inequality in all its forms. The de Blasio administration has always been committed to these ideals and during the pandemic, we have all been especially focused on ensuring that all New Yorkers have food on their tables and a roof over their heads. However, we know that despite our best efforts, far too many families continue to struggle through these unprecedented times. And so it warms my heart that the United Nations Chamber Music Society is sharing their talents and hosting this concert to benefit homeless New Yorkers. In addition to bringing joy during these turbulent times, this concert is a testament to the truth that we all are, that we are all united in the fight to end poverty, eliminate inequality, and forge a better future for all. And now it is my pleasure to read a mayoral message from Mayor Bill de Blasio. Dear friends, it is a pleasure to join the UN Chamber Music Society of the United Nations Staff Recreation Council as it hosts a concert to benefit homeless New Yorkers. New York's phenomenal cultural energy has long inspired and attracted artists from every corner of the map. The UN Chamber Music Society strengthens our vital performing arts sector through its concerts featuring talented United Nations personnel and members of our thriving diplomatic community. This gift ensemble also gives back by championing the UN's mission to promote peace and security, advance freedom and equality, and address the world's most pressing crisis. Funds raised tonight at tonight's event will support Invisible Women New York City, an organization based at the UN International School that assists homeless women living in New York City. This gathering is also a terrific occasion to applaud everyone associated with the society for their efforts to connect our diverse residents to the joys of classical music and showcase the remarkable creativity, generosity, and spirit of inclusion that define our global city and unite us all. On behalf of the city of New York, please accept my best wishes for a wonderful evening and continued success. Enjoy the show.
Good afternoon. My name is Dan Brenner, and I am the Executive Director of the United Nations International School, the School of the UN. I am here today with our students for this concert in celebration of World Day for Social Justice. Social justice is built into the fabric of our curriculum. Eunice's mission is to educate and inspire our students to become an active force in shaping a better world. Today's concert focuses on sending support to homeless women, an issue that one of our student clubs, Invisible Women, has focused on for the last four years. While this group began as Invisible Women in 2016, the seeds for this club were planted in 2014 when these students were in M3, or our seventh grade. It began with an innocent observation and a question. Why is it the people who help the homeless are those who have experienced homelessness. It also began with a hard look at our own privilege. Through the student self-motivation, they have raised funds and awareness to support homelessness women in the community, and their club has grown from 10 students to 80. These students are committed to make a positive impact in changing our world, and as a school, and personally, we are proud of them. Finally, I want to thank Brenda Van Gova the Artistic Director of the UN Chamber Music Society, who has met with our students several times over the past few years for supporting their efforts and for making this concert possible. Thank you again. Um.